Ready? Go ahead. Here we go. Tell me when it's start. recording now. Oh, okay, cool. So, How to Draw Comics the Marvel Way is the book I'm going to talk about today. It's by Stan Lee and John Buscema. John Buscema, or Buscema, I don't know how to pronounce it. Uh, he was really good at drawing comics. He actually uh, ran a college course at a college teaching people how to draw comic book related art, also called uh, sequential art. Uh, and this book actually teaches you a lot of things. They talk about tools of the trade. I can't show you the whole book, obviously. But, uh, these, this is really good. So they teach you basic information. They talk a little bit about different panels and why they're designed the way they are. Um, they talk about practicing the basics. It's really good. Uh, I talk about different books, different art books. They talk about shading and how it gives depth to two-dimensional objects, or the illusion of depth, rather, causing it to appear as if it were a three-dimensional object. Here, they explain the different types of perspective. This is really good, because you have two point, one point. They talk about horizon lines. They demonstrate how it causes your eyes to see the different page of the panel, which is really nice. Uh, this book has actually been around a long time. According to this, it's been around since the 1970s, so the copyright is 1978. And it says first Fireside Edition 1984, whatever that means. But, uh, this book is actually really good. They explain vanishing points and things like that here. That's really cool. And they explain making diagrams and stuff like that. Then they talk about the human figure. I'm not going to touch too much on that. But they show the basic shapes. The step-by-step -step guide on this would be really nice. But... They don't give you that. They just give you uh, the basic shapes. This is actually really important because you want to practice body pose and gesture, especially if you want to draw comics. And uh, I've been doing that, actually. This here that you see is actually from a YouTuber I follow called Mikey Mega Mega. He's great. He has really good... Mikey Mega Mega has really good form gesture practice videos and I've actually been learning a lot about how to draw by watching YouTube videos but I'm not here to talk about that I'm here to talk about drawing see this is about fleshing out the drawing to make it be a more filled out character if you want to learn how to draw comics specifically like comic book characters and panels this is a really good book for that because it explains a lot of things that you need to do, or at least practice, such as this. And it also talks about the basics of other things, like how to keep things in perspective, and how different viewpoints change, and things like that. And how everything is really based upon learning basic shapes and then changing them into what you want them to be. Like so. I would say this is one of the better how to draw books that I've had over the years. And when you get more advanced, you can practice this. Pretty good. This is a book I would recommend because of everything it can teach you to do. Different head shapes. I actually got up there longer so you can see it better. I think I may have gone through this a little too quick, but 
Like I said, this book, drawing for comics, or how to draw comics rather, is really, really good. They explain panel composition here and why you should design them this way and why scenes should look that way. That's actually really cool. And then in the back of the book, they say you should draw your own comic page and practice it, which is actually really good advice. Here on the back, it talks a bit about the two people who okay. published the book, John Luscombe and Stan Lee. Yeah, cool. Alright. So, I would say... This book is really worth checking out. And if you want to learn to draw, this is a great book for that. Especially for drawing comics. Now, uh, as I said earlier... Part one, what? I like learning to draw from other YouTubers, such as Draw with Jazz and Mikey Mega Mega. My two favorite how to draw video tutorials come from those two individuals. And the reason for that is I get to watch them draw live, and I get to draw along with them on their videos, and that makes learning to draw a lot easier, actually. And it's actually really cool, so you should check out their videos. They're really awesome. Mikey Mega Mega and Drawing with Jazz very very good how to draw YouTube tutorials and if you want to check out this book you should well that's all the time I have for today thanks for listening and have a good night